And we also have another reciprocating compressor, except this one is semi-hermetic, means it's bolted together. You can unbolt these and rebuild them. They usually rebuild them there at the factory um, or a service station, but they are semi-hermetic being boltable. The other ones are hermetically still welded, semi-hermetic bolted, but this is also a reciprocating compressor. You're gonna have your crankshaft here and your pistons will be right here at the top. This is our valve plate. So you have your suction side and your discharge side and your other service ports here. This one even includes our oil sight glass and we have a very special tool we're gonna to use for this. And we're gonna, when we get to refrigeration, we're gonna show how to adjust that, how to do our oil fill. These also have these other grooves around here. In some cases, we use a chilled water system to cool the compressor. Our motor side, our motor connections are here in the top and then our electrical side compressor side is going to be over here. But uh, these are semi-hermetic compressors, really cool, mainly in refrigeration. You do still see some in older systems. Uh, we took apart a 1950s Coke machine, had a semi-hermetic compressor in it, but uh, all different types of voltages, all different types of power. Get the Copeland mobile app and it has over here tons of information to tell you everything about this compressor. And what I want you to do is anytime in your career, if you get a chance to take a compressor teardown class, take it. It's going to tell you how to identify what is wrong with your old compressor. It's a great class. You can get with Trevor Matthews or Don Gillis. They are both fantastic instructors for that class. And you will learn a ton of information about it. And um, just never stop learning. But these are our reciprocating compressors, semi-hermetic, bolted together. We'll take this guy apart in the future once we get to the commercial side.